there might be a green something in the water there. See it. Oh, I see fish here already. Jug. Look over there on the bottom. Uh, a couple. A couple. Well, we don't need too many. Uh, it is, but I don't, with so many boats, you can't drag this stuff behind the, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. No. This whole mouth is mine. That's a little... Well, how am I supposed, they're casting to the, how do I go around him now? Okay, I, I don't want to cut through the bank because I saw him casting towards the bank. Yeah, casting to both sides. How do I go around then? Have you noticed that... If you are a cat fisherman and you don't wear bibs, nobody will respect you in the industry. Yeah, there is something about catfishing and bibs. They're, not, they're like peanut butter and jelly. And nobody will give you any respect if you just wear a winter jacket and pants. They will be like, what are you? You're a joke? Yeah. Put some bibs. What are you, a blue yeah, fisherman? yeah. Put some bibs. <laughs> Put yourself together. <laughs> I just started a minute ago. Didn't clean my jacket yet, though. Okay, I'm spot locked. <laughs> Good morning, everyone, from beautiful Tennessee. I'm here with Mr. Realistic Fishing today. Hey. And as God is my witness, I will make a video of me fishing with him today, even if I catch nothing. This is probably my fifth, I don't know, fifth or fourth, at least four, I think. Three, four trips, I don't know, maybe three. I thought four trips with him. No, three last year, just on Percy Priest. Yeah. Then one this year, and that's the second. Yeah. Five trips, I never made a video. If you think, um, if I ever left the impression that I catch them every time, well, that is absolutely not true. But we are fishing today in a... What you would expect, I don't know, I don't know if this is even too crowded, given that this is a power plant and it's almost December. So I will take my blessings. We have enough space. There is some... There is some bluegill or yellow bass right around here. So we're gonna fish around at least uh, one hour, two hours. And... Well, look at this. Huh? We're gonna have a good day, maybe. Yellow. Yellow? That's a fat yellow, though. Nice. That is a fat yellow. Well... Let's not waste any more time. Let's start Jigaroo. This is two gram tungsten. I always start heavier. There is a little bit of current here. I start heavier so, I mean, there is more sensitivity, easier casting. If heavier works, if heavier works, I like heavier. If it doesn't work, then the torture begins. Then you go lighter, you change lures, the torture begins. I even have a... F that is a fish and he... And he is not... Oh, no way, man, this is so small. I was already, I was already thinking I got a, like a large mouth or something. Where did I put the, can you hand me the net? I'm afraid to lift this with my line. Thank you, sir. So. <sighs> well, one little yellow bass. Alex got a like 11 inch fat chunker. But we're gonna catch some fish today and we're gonna make a video fishing with realistic fishing. 
I'm also fishing with a new camera. I'm gonna put this here if you need it. I don't have external microphone. I'm sick and tired of these external microphones. Always the battery always dies. Let's try a swim bait. This swim bait. Oh 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 oh. Yeah, I mean well this is two and a half gram swim bait. Now baby bluegill. Six inch if I have to put money. No overstating. <laughs> It's funny, the Kaitik is on a heavier jig head. I was fishing a 2 gram, twitching a 2 gram, which I think was too heavy because it's only like 5 or 6 feet where I'm casting. But because the lure has much bigger body, it has more drag in the water and sl it sinks slower even though the head itself is heavier. I think the problem is they saw us uh, catch the yellow bass and they thought it's full of fish here. Now let's let's drop down. There is more fish. Oh, oh, oh. Okay now. Okay now. Yeah, he's like you, you, you can hit him on the head. <laughs> is this my first? Is this my first nine incher of the day? Yeah. I don't think so. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> now I hate these things, folks. I used to love them in Chicago, but here there is so much other fish. I hate these things. Uh, let's see how many we put in the bucket. Uh, we'll feed them to some birds. I'll take the big one. Okay. I have water if you want. I have two bottles, but I do not drink any water when it's cold. Yeah. To cold steel, I feel yellow, yellow bass can destroy anything. <laughs> but this one right under the boat. I'm not even using live scope. No, but he's going in the bucket. We're going to feed them to some birds. He going in the bucket. Can you put the bucket on my seat? It's not going to bother you there and I can reach it. Alex, I don't see anything anymore here. Maybe... Per, per <laughs> Folks, there was a bunch of fish here, but I don't know what happened. What? What? What could it be? Give me some uh, suggestions. <laughs> yeah, I don't see nothing here. Yeah, let's be let's be the bigger. Let's be the bigger man and drop a few feet. I promise you, we'll find something. Let's let's drop. I I don't wanna. All of these fish are good eat. And on top of them, drum is a. It's a predator. It's not like carp feeding on weeds or. Yeah, they'll eat any. Drum will chase down a crayfish. Yeah, but I mean, what is the difference between the diet of a drum and bass? I don't understand why drum has such bad. Because it looks dopey. It looks dopey, you're right. It doesn't look nice. Dip, yeah. I'm sure. Because the way he hit. There he is. It is mine. Now, skipjack looks amazing. Looks like it. Incredibly delicious saltwater fish. 
<laughs> but it's yucky. Man, Alex caught all the big ones. I got the little one. Even though, in all fairness to me, right now of the two of us, I'm the one fishing with the bigger lure. If you guys would believe that. <laughs> That's right, right? Yeah. I'm the one fishing with the bigger lure, hoping to get a screamer of some kind here. Nice piece of bait here. I mean, these fish should be delicious. They look absolutely amazing, right? Yeah. Is, is this another skipjack? Right in front of the boat. Come on, one white bass. Woo. Skipjack. This is, this is what all the catfish boats were after. Yeah, I wonder if they caught any. I didn't see any. Uh, we'll take some. Man, that is a slab of a skipjack. Awesome. I don't know what kind of video will this end up being, but we'll take a few slab skipjacks, both Alex and I, let me promise you that. We're gonna take a few skipjack just fine. I grabbed him by the tongue, not the lip, but they have a tongue. <laughs> it was hooked for the tongue. Now my gloves are already incredibly stinky. Always ink so snaggy. Got him? Yeah. Man, we are doing good with the skipjack today. Yellow. Wow. Wow, not yellow, oh, white. This is what I'm looking for. Where did you get it? Why I don't see nothing? I don't see nothing. That's a fat little white. Yeah. Oh, look, look, look. You're right. Look. There's some out there. There's some out there. I'll take some white bass. I'll take some white bass. If you want, you can drop some of the little ones. Let them drift. Uh, yeah. Use the... Let me give you other pliers for this one. Are, the needle nose are very easy to bend. If you're just removing hook, use the old one. This one I do when I tie uh, rigs and I need something. Oh, something is pulling from my rod. Okay. <laughs> That's incredible. I was just handling the and something. Oh, look again. <laughs> oh, again. There we go. They here, dude. I was I was not even reeling. If you want, you can put it on the floor. Yeah, yeah. That's perfect right there. That's not yellow though. He jumped three feet clear of the water. Skippy, yeah. skippity skip. Skippity skip jack. I mean, we can really make someone catfish angler's day if we give him a dozen of these. Yeah. <laughs> right? They love those, if we give, and we already caught, uh, this is my third, you got more than me, we already have a dozen. Skipjack is a good sport, you gotta love them. Let's try to fish this kitek a little bit more aggressive. Because both yellow bass and skipjack, see I told you, I started jerking it real fast yeah if there wasn't enough boats here when we published this video <laughs> if there wasn't enough catfish boats there were more catfish boats here than okay he came off but he was not a big one and I should have had the net out I mean the net is right here he trashed long enough, I should have had the net out. To compare the two wives on video, you would have to play your wife on, on speed 5 or speed 3. Then your wife would look similar on video to the wife of a skipjack. Yeah, 
keep jacks very far I don't know why I'm waiting for them to trash. I'm used to, I'm used to uh, netting fish when they when they are calmed down, when they're tired, and when I see them, I just don't have the instinct. When when they're still trashing, I kind of wait for them to tire instead of. I kind of wait for them to tire instead of uh, trying to net them. Maybe ten incher, maybe. I gotta measure just one of them to get an idea. I have a good eye for crappie, but... Oh! Oh my gosh! I started reeling! Yeah, I started reeling! I started reeling to recast... Yellow! Yellow! <laughs> Man, this one fat, fat like white bass, right? It has exactly the same body. No. Look at the stripes. Stripes yellow. You don't need to look at the belly. No stripes, white. Do you want this one? Okay. Uh huh. If you don't have current when you reel, you keep it off the bottom. But when you have current, right here, man, right under the boat. Oh, this is not a... Is that a white bass? I think so. Uh oh, that's a nice one. Is that... A, that's a whitey. That is a whitey. Yeah. Now, I don't know if this is a white. It's... Yeah, right? His mouth's so big, I think so. But he has stripes. White bass have stripes? Very pale. Look at yours. He looks like a white bass to tell you the truth. Some stripes. And my white... Oh, that, that's a white bass. It depends on the angle. From some angle it doesn't have stripes. That's a good white bass. Funny, did you see how many fish I caught today right when I'm lifting the lure? Right when you're lifting it, they chase it for 30 feet, they don't want to bite it, but when you start to lift, that is a good meter. Good. Oh, that was a curved. Did you see? I tossed it around the corner. Even then, I don't think the, the catfish has memory. Oh, I recognize this oil. That is a skipjack. That's ridiculous to me. Okay, imagine for a second a blue catfish. Uh -huh. Did you imagine? Yeah. Now imagine for a second a skipjack. Uh -huh. Now tell me how, good one. how do you think, how on earth can a blue catfish catch a skipjack? That's impossible. You can put them in a 30 gallon aquarium. And maybe it's, if it's injured or something. Maybe if it's injured, that's the only way. If it is chopped up, in pieces. That's the only way a blue catfish can catch and eat a skipjack. You can put them in a hundred gallon tank. It still has no hope of catching a skipjack. Skipjack can run circles around a blue catfish and the blue catfish has zero... Nice one, meaty. Yeah, Finally finding some white bass. Yeah. Yeah, so, I don't think it can catch a skipjack. I don't think it can catch a skipjack. Only hit by propeller or something. Oh, that sounds good, man. Doubled up. Wow. We waited a long time for a fish and then we doubled up. What do you got? You tell me that they don't move in and out. When they move in, you know what I mean? Nope, none of us caught a fish for like 30 minutes. Uh -huh. and, and, then and then there they were. I got a nice size skipperoo here. Skipperoo, somebody finally ate the green color. Oh man, they look so juicy these skipjacks. 
look at this juicy looking fish. I'm sure that guy over there would come. Yeah, he'll take it. He'll take it, but we'll let him go. Now, I don't eat skipjack, but for some reason I love them, I always release them. As soon as I say something, they moved in. Uh, this drag is pretty tight. If we feel, I'm going to yank now. If I feel a bite, I'm a yank. I, you can't say I didn't set the hook in this one. I yanked pretty good. Oh, and I still lost him. I mean, skipjack is a challenge for eye fish, let me tell you. Is it Steven now? You know, look, <laughs> did you see? Under the boat, incredible. This fish came 10 times. He did not let go. You gotta, you gotta give it to this Mr. Skipper for his perseverance. He came, he missed it, he missed it 10 times. He missed 10 times before he got it. Man, I feel we can load up a bucket of skipjack today and make... Is this a, something heavier? No. Man, that's a good one, man. This here is a, so meaty. Oh, take it. I'm sorry, but both hands are... Uh, There you go. Yeah, the net is like that. All right. Oh, double up skipjack. Good ones. Good ones. When they move in, uh, yours is fat too. Oh, he's looking at us right now. <laughs> he's looking at us right now. Man, this is, if this is a skipjack. Did I snag this fish? It feels very heavy. Interesting why it felt so heavy. It's not snagged. This fish felt heavy, folks. I'm just not used to catching fish right now. That is a fatso. He not long, but he a fatso. We'll keep this guy. But since we're keeping anyway, right? Yep. Oh. Whoa, easy. <laughs> I think I got him. Okay, yeah. take it easy now. It's very thin line. Hello. Okay. See, Alex, if you spend seven hundred dollars on tackle, <laughs> I can also catch a <laughs> Stop telling people to use pinch on sinkers. <laughs> You're killing me. <laughs> Let some wine. Let some wine uh, out. You're killing me, man, with your pinch on sinkers. Choked it. He choked it. Oh, miracle. I don't know if he's gonna make it, but I think he will not go to waste if he dies. Uh, let me put uh, one uh, last lure. Let's put a natural color. Not because I think you need natural, but because I have one outside already. Probably from a prior trip. Right there. All right. Let's catch one more. Show folks that this is not accident. There's not a lot of current here. Look at these leaves. There we go. I saw him bite it on the scope. There we go. I don't think it's a skipjack. If it is, they're just slowly. Easy, landing. easy, 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 easy. No horse roo. Because you know what happens with my $2. You're going to see $2 swim away. <laughs> <laughs> I got him now. That's yeah. Cool. All right. That's enough, folks. That's enough. 
that's that's it folks all you need to catch skipjack if you know why it's not biting you didn't spend enough money on your on your tackle yeah. add a few hundred dollars and you can catch skippy jack like this <laughs> just like me and alex all right that's a beautiful outro thank you for watching and we are disconnecting from beautiful tennessee bye bye